Welcome everybody to a unboxing video. I made a purchase from a fellow YouTuber, Spooch Game Hunting. I will put a link to his channel in the description box below. Um, he had some Power Ranger stuff that I was interested in and we made a deal and this is what we got. I already pre-opened it to uh, check it out because I knew all the stuff that was in there. But I will share it with you guys now. We have a letter. It says, Robert, thanks for watching the channel. I appreciate the support. Hope you enjoy the power in your stuff. We'll let you know if I come across any, come across more. Spruch Game Hunting. He, has, he does toy hunt videos and video game hunt videos. Go check him out. As I said, I'll put a link to his channel in the description box below. Got some bubble wrap. Now some of the stuff I already looked at and uh, put together, pieced together what it was supposed to. First off, we have the Black Armor Dino Thunder Ranger, played by Jason David Frank. Uh, Tommy. As all you might know is the original Green Ranger from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. But it's a pretty cool figure. Got his weapon. It had a head part on it. It must have fell off into the box, but that's okay. Nas, this one's for you. Hope you like it. Alright, next we got from Power Rangers Mystic Force. We got the Mystic Phoenix. Uh, this is the series where each of the Rangers would turn into their respective Mystic Titans, as they were called. And then they would form two of their different versions, which would be the Dragon Formation and then the Megazord. Pretty cool figure. I'll do a review on this another day. And we also got here... From, uh, from Power Rangers Dino Thunder. We have the Stegozord. Or Stegozord, whatever they called it then. Very nice figure. Very good shape. Very important. It's got the tail tip. A lot of that stuff comes missing in, from years of playing and stuff like that. But the motor function does work. I tested it out. I have to get some more batteries to uh, put it together. Very cool. Always been looking for this one. Now that I have it. And we have. Missing his arms. But. From uh, SPD. I forgot his name. Should have done the research. To be better prepared for the video. But oh well. But yeah. It looks like he's part of like a. Megazord. Armor thing. I guess. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> then we have half of the Mystic Mermaid from Mystic Force. Also was part of the tail on the dragon formation and he would become part of the legs. Um, anybody has the other half and is willing to trade for it, let me know. Uh, so we'll need the Mystic Sprite, because I don't have that one, two, okay, and then we have here, Nick, from uh, Mystic Force, this is uh, one of those armor transforming into the animal, I think it was, uh, oh, what was it, Fireheart. Transforms into Fireheart. You can see. I just flip the head down, tuck him into his chest, and up comes Fireheart's head. Pretty neat. I'm not really much of the figures, but I like this one because he was one of my favorite Rangers. And it's always good to have in the collection. Next we have. Mystic Taurus from Power Rangers Mystic Force. Also a good figure. Missing his horns and the 
hat for the hell for the Megazord formation. You can see the face there. Pretty cool. Always wanted this Megazord, just never had a chance to find it. Well, not willing to pay the prices they want on eBay for a full Megazord. But that's pretty cool. Another one to add to my collection. And we got the Mystic Force Titan Megazord. It's just a yeah action figure. Pretty cool though. I'll go up in the collection, onto the shelf, into the collection as I meant to say. Then we have Mystic Garuda, I think he was called. There's his head. See his nice head there. And, um, all of them together, they always had the M for Mystic Force on their chest. He's missing his arms, which become the wings for the dragon. But easy to find. I have plenty of friends that will help me find that. If I don't find it on my own. Then we got, let's see here. The wings for the Dino Thunder, the White Ranger's Zord. I forgot his name right now. It's, uh, I have to look up Drago Zord, I think it was called. But that's pretty cool. I'll, just, I'll find the middle piece and complete that Megazord that goes along with this guy here. Here comes his legs. Mentioned the missing the waist piece to connect it together, but that's okay. I'll find it eventually. And we have another uh, Mystic Force Red Ranger. Nick is his name in the show figure. Very cool sculpt. Oh, well, I agree with a lot of other people, reviewers online. I need to do more paint on the back. And make the figure a lot much better. And we got some random bits in here from SPD. Pretty cool. Mystic Force Shield. Does light up. I don't know if you guys can see that too well because of the light. There you go. Pretty cool. I'll find some use for that. And we also got another Titan Megazord figure here. That's the back part. And then there's the front. Missing the middle piece for the chest. To form, it forms the whole chest shield on there. But that's okay. I'll find it eventually. Or I'll put it. Someone will purchase it. And then we got the SWAT Megazord from Power Rangers um, SPD. Missing his foot. That's okay. Pretty cool figure. And if you turn it around and stuff here, he becomes the SPD Red Ranger. Neato. Just like I said, missing his foot there. But what can you do? It's all part of way toys are found nowadays at the flea markets and what other wherever they're found and yet again just another red ranger mystic force figure missing his leg i think it's in the box somewhere i'm not going to dig it out right now that's okay and we got the helmet for sbd red ranger sorry about that pretty cool looks like it's for like a 12 inch or 16 inch figure Kind of like, kind of like, looks like a Ken doll, but you just snap the helmet on, boom, and he's a Power Ranger. Very neat. Got some other little bits and stuff in here. Yeah. Operation Overdrive Red Ranger PVC figure. I also got a. Get this little thing off of there. A chiller, also from Operation Overdrive with the henchmen for the bad guys. Pretty cool. And then we got... Okay, here's that arm I was telling you. 
through the part of the weapon for the Dino Thunder Black Ranger there. See, pretty cool. Pretty neat. And we got the gyro copter or whatever it was called from uh, Operation Overdrive. And it's probably part of a. I don't think it's the actual Megazord piece. It doesn't fold up or nothing. I'll have to research that better. And a couple weapons and some other little bits. I think goes part of that Green Ranger to make them into the Megazord there. I'll have to play around with that later and see. But here's also the arm. I guess the uh, left arm for the White Ranger. Dino Thunder's uh, Megazord. I don't remember what the name of it was offhand, but other than that, that's about it. A couple of random bits and pieces in here. Stuff to uh, check out and uh, see what I can do with it. If not, you know, everybody knows I'm up for trade or trading. And. A little bit of a channel update though, um, I've kind of been on the injured list so I haven't really been able to go out and hunt that much so hunting videos will be coming soon I could say. Um, I don't know when, I have to go back to the doctors in a couple of days and see how my heel is. Injuries, what can you do? Um, also... I don't know, I'm up to now 29 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying to get up to 50. Once I get up to 50, I'm going to do a contest. I'm still working out the details for it, but that will be coming once I hit 50 subscribers. So I appreciate everybody and all your support. I thank you very much. I know it's not the best channel in the world, but I do the best I can. I'm um, working on getting more equipment and better lighting. As you can see, I'm trying different lighting here. It's getting there slowly. Getting a little more comfortable in figuring things out and how to set things up and that. I'm working on getting a room clean next door in the attic. Finishing it all up so I can have my own little studio review area and all that. Um... That's a work in progress, but with the heat, it's in the attic. I don't really do much over there without air conditioning, so. We'll see how it goes. Little by little, I'm getting there. But, as I said, thank you guys for all the support. Um, hope you enjoy the videos. I know I'm not the best talker, but I've been trying. And I appreciate it. So, you guys have a wonderful day, and I will see you next video.